Good morning, just woke up. Um, I just got an email, check my phone here, and I got an email from two of my Bicycle Terrain Pro readers who are here in the Flagstaff area, and they are doing a bike packing route around Flagstaff and Sedona and this whole area. And they told me where they were, kind of. They're near Mormon Lake, which is about 25 miles away from where I am right now. But I'm gonna drive there to Mormon Lake and I'm gonna try to find them. I don't know if it's possible, because they're still on the move. It's the middle of the day right now. It's like 11 o'clock. Will I be able to find them? Will I not? Let's find out. Here we go. <laughs> So my first stop here, I'm, I'm at the gas station, the Maverick gas station. Oh, this car is gonna friggin' pull right in front of me. Okay, I just picked up my Chipotle burrito, and while I was in there, I got a message from Joe and Brian. It says, we are just outside of Mormon Lake. We will wait for you at the lodge. Take your time. There's a link, I'm guessing that's where they are. Joe and Brian Walters. Okay, I'm in Mormon Lake now, and the speed limit is 10 miles an hour. They said they're gonna be at the lodge, and I have no idea where the lodge is, so... Just looking for two guys on bikes, I guess. Your destination is on the left. Ah, oh, there's the lodge, Mormon Lake Lodge. Question is, where can I park? There they are, right there. Hey guys, how long have you been here? Uh, hey, hey. hey. okay, yeah, sorry, it took, okay. took a while longer to get here. He's, uh, he has really nice music on his... Uh, he does, he does a really good job. And it's music you've never heard before, but... Uh, so I found Joe and Brian and their bike packing bikes here. Um, we just had lunch at the Mormon Lake Lodge and now they're gonna uh, mount their bicycles and ride back onto the trail here and I'll probably ride with them for a little bit so um, yeah so do you have a you have the sleeping mat sleeping bag and tent yeah I have a hammock oh no no tent okay Pardon me? no tent no just tent. the hammock I, I'm considering sleeping under the stars tonight, but yeah. I, I, what, what I'll do is not put the rain fly on my hammock. Oh, uh, okay. Open the, open the uh, bug fly. Yeah. Because I'd like to see the stars. Yeah. And I have no vested interest in this, but the Gaia app for mapping yeah. is amazing. Oh, uh, okay. Like, yeah, you can like... Yeah, it doesn't, road, it's, it's, The thing it does that differentiates it from other apps I've seen is uh, you can create a route that goes on, along a trail uh, and it'll, like, it'll, it'll, it doesn't have to be a road, road okay? Yeah. And it's gonna, it's gonna actually map the whole thing and tell you the distance, which is, uh... That's unique. Yeah. Four years ago, I was in Vermont. And this name was some warm showers, people. Uh -huh. And uh, the couple, uh, the couple who wrote the, the bike touring book on Cuba. Yeah, that's okay, great. Luck. Yeah, thanks. Yeah. It's a pleasure meeting you, sir. Thank you so much for waiting up for me there. It was a pleasure. And I don't yeah. Know, I've, I've followed you for years. So. Oh, thanks. Yeah. And you well. know something else? So, just as a result of the <laughs> brief conversation we had, yeah. there's like a guy that I probably haven't seen oh, yeah. in 15, 20 years, 
and and he said, "Hey, I wouldn't mind doing that trip maybe next year." <laughs> like you know, so yeah, he, he yeah. kind of reconnected us. Which yeah, is really cool. it is cool. Yeah, yeah. So well, keep up the great work. Man. All right. Yeah. Well, have fun. Okay. I wish I was going with you guys. <laughs> Well, you know, we might like it so much that we're going to want to do a second. Yeah, so right. I, do, I doubt that. <laughs> All right. Well, have fun, and okay. maybe I'll see you in Flagstaff. Yeah, hopefully. Take care, guys. Bye. All right. So I just met up with Joe and Brian, really nice guys from Canada. They're in the middle of their bike packing trip here in northern Arizona. Um, I'm back at the car now. I rode with them for a little bit, rode back to the car, and now I'm going to drive to a nearby campsite that's about 16 miles away. So it's going to take me about half an hour or so to get there, but uh, yeah, the goal now is to find a place to camp. Okay, so I'm at Marshall Lake. Just arrived at Marshall Lake just outside of Flagstaff, Arizona. Uh, I'm gonna spend the night here. It is super cold and windy outside today. Um, so I'm probably just gonna set up camp. Oh, there's some cows coming through. There's some cows walking right through camp here. What? Hold on. Just wandering through, they're looking at me like, what is that strange big white cow over there? Hey guys, wait for me. So I'm probably just gonna hop out of the driver's seat here, jump in the back and work on my computer for the rest of the evening. I got some video editing to do, some website stuff. And yeah, and that's pretty much it. Tomorrow I'm gonna go into town and I'm gonna work from the library and do some computer work pretty much all day long and then I'll come back out into the forest in the evening. So that's the plan for today and tomorrow. Woo!